two bipartisan bills, and I look forward to working to finalize the conference report. I want to thank Chairman Schuster for working with me during markup and on the floor to restore the new starts, small starts, and core capacity programs and to strike changes that have delayed many transit projects. Instead, we now have a bill that will help transit systems build up their capacity and serve their riders well. I'm also pleased that the bill includes priorities I worked on, such as strengthening the tank car safety rule and preserving increased funding for state of good repair, as well as Buy America increases in technical assistance eligibility and language helping to deploy zero emission buses. I'm also a member of the Science, Space, and Technology Committee, and the House bill contains language based on my research bill, the Future Trip Act. First, the bill creates a regional transportation center on connected vehicles and connected infrastructure. Connected vehicles are a big part of the solution to alleviating congestion and improving safety. And this technology will certainly become more prevalent. I think we should be doing more to re research the impacts and opportunities stemming from connected and automated vehicle systems. In addition, the House bill has language for a GAO study on connected vehicles an interagency working group on transportation research, improvements in UTC proposal regulations, and a pavement technology deployment program. Of course, the bill is not perfect, starting with the need for higher authorization levels. Now, as a member of the freight panel last Congress, led by Vice Chairman Jimmy Duncan, I'm pleased to see freight programs in both bills for the first time. In the conference report, we need to allow for a series of integrated pieces to count as one freight project. And the freight program must be truly multimodal, as we all know freight movement is. After all, we'll be funding the bill with a substantial percentage of general revenues, not just the Highway Trust Fund. We certainly have our work cut out for us. I look forward to rolling up my sleeves and getting this critical bill done. And finally, before I yield back, I have to mention, yes, my, my tie that I'm wearing is a statement, and I'm happy that TAP has been included in this bill. Without objection, so ordered. Uh, next, we go to Mr. Perry for an opening statement. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Through the